together and I'm here for my 33 week pregnancy vlog and I feel like I'm finally back to a regular vlog without kiddos running around and getting distracted and all that kind of stuff. So I feel like I have a lot to tell you guys. Yeah, I'm feeling huge. I'll just start off with that. I feel so big to be 33 weeks and be 34 weeks soon. And I still have so, we have so much to do. So much to do. If you haven't seen our daily vlogs recently, go check them out. We're doing the girls' rooms as far as trying to get the room situated for Kinsley and Claire sharing a room. And she just got her big old bed. And I'm pretty sure I uploaded that vlog yesterday. So go check it out. Getting Camry's room ready. And I've got to still wash all the clothes and get her room organized. And I will for sure be doing a room tour of the girls and the nursery tour once I get those figured out and I feel like I probably should have gotten to this way before now but we've just been so busy summertime just a really busy time and now it's like okay it's here I've got to get busy so I've got to get ready for her to get here I need to get all of our stuff out as far as even our big things and figure out where we're gonna put them I think right there here in the living room I'll have the swing Rock and play. I love rock and play. If you guys out there do not have rock and play and you're watching this and you're pregnant, get a rock and play. They're like, that would be my one favorite item, baby item that you have to have a rock and play. That was a lifesaver for Claire. And I know babies are different, so hopefully it'll be a lifesaver for Camry too. But it was just so awesome. She slept so good. She slept a lot of times in that um, near my bed and just I could rock it a little bit if I needed to. And it just reclines them also. So she, at the very beginning, she had some trouble um, with spitting up and stuff. And so the it being reclined helped a lot with that. And now they have the ones that's auto rock and play. So I'm hoping that I may get one of those at my shower, or that I, or that we can get one at like a consignment event, or a, or just get a new one or whatever. But I really want one of those. I may have that at the salon. I don't know, because I'll probably bring her to the salon with us, especially for at the new place. Joel will be there. And I don't know how the timeline is going to go with our new place coming along, but I'm planning on Joel being able to help and his schedule is a little bit more flexible now. So he'll be able to either babysit if I'm busy or we'll just bring her with us and we'll both be there and we'll just take turns taking care of her. Uh, I love having my babies with me at the hair salon at the beginning because they just sleep. They just kind of hang out and sleep most of the time and they're still there if I need to breastfeed them because I'll be breastfeeding a lot with her. By the way, this is a maternity nursing tank top from all navy i'll show you guys it when i try it on i literally just bought it so if you want it i'm sure they still have it in stock but it's very comfy and soft and it just kind of so like whenever i breastfeed i'll just do like that um it's been all it i tried it on and i was like wow it's a maternity shirt too it's really long and flowy and so it's really comfy so i think i'll be probably wearing this tank top a lot when she gets here too but it's really I really do like it a lot. I got some more maternity tank tops and bras and stuff from there. So, um, I also did a little haul of that in yesterday's vlog. So, if you want to go check it out, check it. I had a 30% off. So, I just went on there and one of my clients told me that she loved their nursing tank tops and bras from All Navy. So, I was like, I'm going to go check it out and I ordered a couple things. So, this tank top that it opens up like on the inside when I breastfeed it. It's a plain black one. I thought it would be good to have to wear under if you want to see what I got from there. Go check it out. Oh, so two th two little things to tell you guys. I'm getting maternity pictures done tomorrow. I hopefully I'll get those back soon and I can share them with you guys and we'll I'm sure we'll be vlogging some. But we're going to Cedar Falls and it's like has waterfalls and stuff and I got these long pretty dresses and I showed you guys my pink one in yesterday's vlog too but I just got a white one also and I got both of those just off of Amazon she was like go look on Amazon there was so many to choose from I didn't know what to choose from but wanted just knew that I wanted a big long like flowy dress and so I decided on those two um, we're gonna do family pictures first for a little bit and then my mom's gonna take them to like play or something and then we'll finish taking my pictures and I think I'm gonna curl my hair I'm not positive yet because it's just so hot but I'm pretty sure I probably will but other thing is the next weekend I'm having a shower sprinkle shower meaning like hopefully I'll get lots of diapers and wipes because it like and we literally have not bought anything yet with having two girls and another girl in the way that's awesome we haven't bought like any, we really have not bought anything I don't know if it's just we've been 
lazy and putting it off, but we've saved a lot. So I, I was looking at what we had and so also a consignment event is coming up very soon, beginning of August in like a couple weeks. So I'm like trying to decide if I want to hold off and see if we can get any deals on stuff there or if I need to go ahead and like get everything ready because I don't know what she's going to get here exactly and it's getting close to time. So I'm not sure, but yeah, and then that's why I'm going to go ahead and have the little sprinkle shower to see what kind of diapers and stuff we get or any gifts that we get so that I can try to decide what else we need because, but I definitely will probably be get, needing to get some diapers stocked up and stuff. I'm like, I can't believe we're about to start all over again with diapers. We just got Claire potty chained, like literally just got her potty chained, just got her big girl bed, just took all her passes away, got the cars fixed up, and now daddy is here he's gonna be like you're up. I was trying to do this video for you guys now they're here they went to a birthday party you guys will see in a vlog soon and yeah hopefully I don't know they're gonna be driving me crazy now and I wanted to get it though okay I'm gonna try to hurry up <laughs> this is because I don't want them to be running around like crazy but so I'm still 140 as far as what I just like here but I probably went more at the doctor but she is about like a pineapple now she's about four to five pounds somewhere in there and now some nice calm. Yeah, I've still been swelling a lot. I've been still working a lot on my feet and stuff. I try to wear my compression socks and tennis shoes most of the time so that it helps with the swelling, but they still, they're still really swollen like crazy. Like I literally just got done at this one. They're so swollen. Oh yeah, dad adjusted me recently and we vlogged that. So if you guys want to see that. Whew, that's not happening. Take a deep breath. All the way out. We're doing Webster technique, and after the adjustment, we try to <laughs> um, release the round ligament that's attached to the uterus. So it is right. It's been awesome to have him be able to adjust me through this pregnancy. Oh yeah. So now because I'm getting so much bigger, and I feel like I did, I did it with Kinsley, and I had her early, and she was still big. But I feel like more people are asking me and would be like, what? I can't believe you're that big already and you still have like a month to go. People ask me all the time like, so when are you due? And I'll say September 5th and they're like, they look at, they look at me so shocked because they're like, what? I thought you were due next week or, you know, a lot sooner, like August, not September. <laughs> so it's just so crazy how big I get and like, it's just crazy. But I didn't feel this big. <laughs> with Claire and she went to her due date so that's why I feel like I'm going to have her early. I really do feel like I'm going to have her early probably. The end of like the end of August probably. Oh yeah and at night I start getting these pains. I go to the doctor on Monday I'm going to ask her about it and I'm taking the girls so stay tuned for that vlog because I think it's going to be a lot of fun. I want to see Claire's reaction to like her heartbeat and stuff and seeing the baby's doctor and everything but I get sharp pains like on the right at the bottom down here like at night time so I don't know if that's Braxton Hicks exactly It'll be like just some sharp pains. I'll just feel so uncomfortable. And and yeah, and it's been harder to sleep at night. Like last night I woke up, had to go to the bathroom and I cannot get comfortable to go back to sleep for like forever it felt like. And I'm usually a really hard sleeper and can sleep really good. I feel like it's just now hitting me here at the end that I'm like, oh, uh, I just wanna get comfy, sleep on my belly. And it's just hard to sleep and get comfy here at the end. I usually do pretty good with it. It's just randomly that I'll have nights like that. So yeah, my belly just feels so tight now, like crazy tight. Like she hardly has any room to it, but she always kicks me like, or moves her feet around like right here on this side. And then I feel some, I don't know if it's her hand or her feet, but it lasts a little stuff over here too. I want to do a hospital bag once I, I want to go back and look at my hospital bag actually to what I brought last time to figure out what exactly we're going to stop. But I just got it Coles 2 nightgown. So I showed you guys that in yesterday's vlog too. This little like nightgown so I can be comfy when I'm at the hospital and when people are visiting and all. Um, and then I also got this one. I love that they let you keep the hangers too. It has like the little tank top and it's got lacy there and then it has the little shorts. So we did a lot in yesterday's vlog as far as pregnancy and room stuff and all that stuff. But, but definitely I got those things for the hospital and where afterwards when people are visiting and all that kind of stuff. If you want to see that too, go check it out. Um, definitely I love, I've gotten stuff now from Kohl's and Old Navy recently. I usually get some things from Target too, but I'll probably get my necessities that I'll tell you guys about exactly what I'll need in my hospital bag. 
soon because I feel like I need to get there early just in case if she could be early. I don't think so. Do y'all plan at the party? Yeah. Cool. And we eat some cake. Y'all eat cake. And, and ice cream. cream. What? And ice cream. <laughs> Alright, so here's the my belly. Daddy, I can catch it. 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 Daddy, I can Baby sister, baby sister, baby sister. I'm right at like 39, 39 inches, yeah. maybe 39 and a half. Is it almost the same or is it bigger? I think it's similar to last week. I can't remember. Was that 39 last week? It, it, it was a little bit. That was right here. It was right here. No, <laughs> it wasn't that far. Over. No, it was five. Well, we're at five. That's what I remember. Now, let me just get this one. And it, she just feels so tight. She kicks me all the time, like right here, here right here. Like I feel like her foot's sticking out right now, right there. I don't know if you can see it. If I look lot, my belly looks lopsided. Now I need a camera kiss. You don't call for a camera kiss. Mom, 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 mom. Oh. Oh, <laughs> Where do you think her head is? Her head's like down here. Booty, ah. Booty's right there? Here. Yeah. Mwah. Right Mwah. here. Mwah. In your head right here. <laughs> <laughs> that was a lovely one. Yeah. You really can't get me, Bob. Put your thing down. In there. really hard in there. Mm. Must want to be. Thanks guys so much for watching. Have a great day. See you guys in our daily vlogs and I'll see you next week and I'll tell you about our doctor appointment then and or stay tuned. You'll see it in the vlog probably before I get to the next pregnancy vlog but yeah so have a great day bye <laughs>